Hello. Today we work in Miller code using MATLAB simulation. What is Miller code? Miller code is a one full weights and bipolar. It's one minus one, one minus one. And the zero it's a half weights between minus one and one. Return to zero. First of all, we need a random integer generator. This is the one that is work in and it is the zero as we work about encoder and decoder first we take uh, XOR between random integer and a the output of this flip flop and the CLK we put a pass generator and the input of uh, flip flop it's the output of XOR one for clear to make uh, the value not zero we multiply by two then we add it to minus one and the product it is the integer random integer generator we have this code this is a one full width and bipolar one minus one one minus one one minus one and the zero press zero this is a random integer generator Second, we XOR uh, the random integer generator, which is 1, to have uh, the 1 becomes 0 and 0 becomes 1. Second, we add it to minus 1, so the 0 becomes 0 and uh, 1 becomes minus one, uh, 0, so it becomes minus 1 and uh, the 0 that becomes at 1, so it becomes 0. And what is the so this uh, pulse generator have a help full width because uh, zero it's a help width. We multiply it by fifteen percent of period so pulse width. When we multiply it by the generator with minus one, we have this scope. The zero becomes a half weight between minus one and one, minus one and one, and the one one zero is zero. Why we do this XOR? We do it because when we work and this code with half weights and at it, we have this half weights and zero and minus two. I don't need minus two. I don't. I want one bit and minus one. So I, this XOR when we add it together, together we have uh, the full width between minus one and one, minus one and one, and one is one, not zero. So we add it with this signal that we have XOR with one and have this output the one is zero to add it with uh, the one above and uh, the zero is between minus one and one minus one and one minus one and one and this is generic integer the encoder is the addition between zero and one we have this is what we see the first time is the signal, second one is one, third one is zero, and the fourth one is addition. This is the signal, this is one, this is zero, and the addition. One is a full width, one one, and zero is a half width between minus one and one. One minus one, minus one one. This is a Miller code encoder. Second, when we work about decoder, it's very simple. We subtract the zero, we work on it here, with the output encoder. So we have a pulse between minus one and one. When we make it in valor and absolute value, we have this signal. Here, when we subtract zero, Zero the rest zero and one is bipolar between minus one and one is two bits. When we have a absolute value, 
so pulse signal becomes one thank you for watching and i hope i can help you more thank you